Hey everyone, this is intentionally unintentional. Back with another video. I just received my monthly shipment from Scentbird, which is a cologne subscription service. be my last one because I've been doing it for a few months now and I have enough to last me a while and I've tried the ones that I want to try. I'll make another video with all of them. I know I keep saying I'm gonna do it but I will. Um, but yeah I just thought uh, I would open this up and show you what I got smelling. I know that a few of you were fans of the Amazon brush unboxing and testing it out, so hopefully this is similar. $35 off custom pants. East Non Bon. I got this one because I heard that it was one of the few on Scentbird that was actually good value for money. It's interesting. Um, when I was first getting into looking at using Scentbird, I was looking at the cons of or just some some points people had made about you know the downfalls of it and one of the main points cited is that you know it's you don't get as much volume wise for what you're paying um, but to be honest I, I don't really see that as a problem because you know you're trying out a bunch of different ones it's not necessarily about getting more for your money it's more about seeing what you like um one of the ones that i tested i'm actually going to get a bottle of um for christmas hopefully i ask for it so anyways um our keys non this has persian saffron coffee myrrh frankincense and sandalwood Smells woody off the cap. Let's just give it a spray on the card here. Hmm. 
I'll let that sit for a sec. It's not the most absorptive, absorbent, absorbent material. Yeah, that's, that's not looking too hot. <laughs> and I can see it's kind of just like sitting there. version of this one earlier. I really liked it, but I heard this one was more wintry, because the other one's kind of a like fresh, citrusy, summer type thing. So hopefully this one's more fit for the winter. I was trying to get two that are good for this season. Um, so to read my little note there. Versace Eros Flame, the new men's fragrance, strikes you right through the heart. A hesperitic, amber, woody fragrance to make the wearer feel strong, passionate, self-confident, and very Versace. And I tell you what, I put these on and I feel very Versace. Um, it's got Italian lemon, pepperwood, and vetive. Uh, it seems French. If it's not French, it's vetiver. But if it's French, it's vetive. <laughs> Take a look. Someone please correct me if I'm butchering that, but... to this one. Hopefully it's dried a little bit more. So, this one just says, a woody, smoky, oriental fragrance. Heavy, captivating, and addictive, like liquid gold. Let's see how accurate that is. Hmm. Okay, it's a little different than when I just smelled it from the cap. Um, can definitely smell the wood and the frankincense and the myrrh. I'm not getting a lot of coffee. It's one of those that, uh, well, one, it's, it's very mature. Um, I'm 23. I could pull this off, but I'd only wear it out to a nice dinner or just like, I don't know. Like, I feel like this is something my dad would wear. I might actually give it to him. But it is good. I keep wanting to smell it, even though I'm not like, you know, I'm not like, this smells amazing, it's just kind of like, it's really nice, and I just, I want to keep smelling it. Thumbs up on that one. Not for everybody, but, yeah. Yeah. This smells very similar to the regular Eros, which is the blue bottle. This one's definitely got some like spice to it. It's it's 
more woody, more spicy, which is good for now because you want warm fragrances right now. You want vanilla, you want amber, you want woody. So, <laughs> thumbs up on that one as well. Sorry if you can hear my phone, my mom on the phone, she's talking to my aunt. Um, but anyways, both of these um, are very good. Um, and if you're interested in colognes, you, you know, you've been kind of skeptical about Scentbird, I would highly recommend it. It's, um, I think I paid just under 24 per month to get two every month. And it allowed me to try a bunch, and I'll, I'll go over that in the collection video I'm planning on doing. But anyways, uh, to keep this one on the shorter side, I'll wrap it up here. Um, thanks for watching. If you made it this far, drop a like, subscribe, um, and I will see you all for the next one.